welcome to Inclusion Uncomplicated. I'm Dr. Nika White. Restorative justice in the work environment. You may have heard of the term restorative justice. Restorative justice is broadly known for its use in the criminal justice system, but restorative justice principles are also applicable to workplace. Restorative justice brings together the person who committed harm, the person who was affected by the harm, and the affected communities with the goal of holding the person who committed harm accountable, while also repairing relationships and building community. Instead of looking at what policies and rules have been violated, restorative justice looks at who has been harmed, how they were impacted, and what they need to feel emotionally safe in the workplace. When one staff member harms another, organizations can use restorative justice practices in place of their normal disciplinary action model. For instance, if someone uses insensitive language toward an LGBTQ plus coworker, the two staff members and other affected parties would be brought together with someone from leadership to have a dialogue that seeks to repair the harm in a way that centers the needs of the staff member who was harmed. Accountability measures would be put in place to ensure that the harm will not be repeated. There would also be some steps the offender has to take that would atone for their actions to the larger LGBTQ community within the organization. Restorative justice allows organizations to confront unconscious and conscious bias in a way that supports their marginalized groups while also building relationships and allyship.